with the drive. And the Dangerous Far Hearts out for 22. Bollinger strikes. And that's the wicket Australia needed. He was in the crease and he wasn't hitting it over Mitchell Johnson's head. He just stopped on the stroke a bit. Maybe the ball stopped on him a bit. A thrilling 22 from Mimran Farhart comes to it. Edge and taken this time. It carries. And the finger goes up. There's the second. This time, there won't be a challenge. Johnson in and he strikes with his fourth bowl. It's good length. And once again, they're talking about all summer how he drags the right hander into playing that shot. That full one outside. Oh, well taken, Haddon. And there's been a... Oh, there's another one gone. What a catch. Brad Haddon, you beauty. Think about Australia needed to go bang, bang. Iqbal caught. Regulation fashion. Brad Haddon, that is a ripper. Absolute screamer. Look at this. He'll be parallel to the ground. Oh, that's a beauty. In the pouch. Australia right back in the game. Three for 51. There he yeah. goes. Yeah. Damn! What a catch! That could win the match for Australia. Nathan Horace has taken a ripper. He went for the captain. He hit it as hard as a rocket. No, I think he's hurt. I think he's injured, but he's held on. What a catch. And he's in real strife. I'd say he's got a broken thumb, finger or something, but this has been hit so hard. It's hit him right in the end of the right thumb. Left thumb it was. Four for 77. To it. Go! Go! Bit of extra bounce there from Nathan Horitz. And I think that uh, Mizbah Al-Haq, after the loss of the last wicket, I think he was being a little cautious. And rather than trying to belt it, just tried to guide it. And with that extra bounce, just got a bit of top edge. Well taken there by Michael Hussey at point. And uh, a very big over for Nathan Horitz. So the fifth wicket is down for Pakistan. And you're now down to the Akmal brothers with a big hope to save the team. It's five for 77. Oh, he got him this time, has he? Yes, he has! Mitchell Johnson, you beauty! He's beaten him a few times out there, and here we go again. Just a little feather. Pakistan, six down for 103. <laughs> he can move forward in that position. Yeah! Oh, was there an outside edge? Haddon thinks he's got him. A couple of noises. And there is a review. He's all right. He's okay. He's a legal delivery, so that's point one for Nathan Horitz. Well, here's your three mobile hotspot, and there you'll just see a little flick. There it is, it lights up that outside edge. Oh, well, he's not even going to look. Mohammed Sami is out now. And uh, it is brilliant. It's seven for 133. And he's gone in the air, he's got a charge. Mitchell Johnson settles under it and takes the beauty. Two to go for the Aussies. This will be an amazing win if they can pull it off. One moment it looked as though he wasn't going to get himself into position. But look at that. Good tactics. Ponting brought his field in with two balls of the over to go and said, go on then. A desperate moment. A wonderful 49. You feel now, though, that it's in a losing cause. Eight for 133. Go on, that's a big one. There's a man out there, it's Watson. He's got good hands. Yes, he has. Well caught, well bowled. One wicket for victory, a great victory for Australia. Danish Canaria knew the man was out there. I think perhaps he was looking to hit it a bit straighter. But he tempted him with the flight. Just got enough spin to get the ball going more mid-wicket than long on. And Australia are within one wicket of a remarkable victory. Time for a drink. An error goes for a duck. Nine for 135. Bim off strike. This is the last ball of the over. He goes again. Down the ground. Could be out. He should be out. He is out. What a victory for Australia. That's one of the all-time great victories. Five wicket for Nathan Horace. Hussey, the match winner, but a good 
all-round performance. Well, quite an amazing turnaround to be uh, 206 behind on the first innings and get up by 36. It's no wonder the Australian players are excited. A wonderful victory for Australia. Disappointing day for Pakistan, but full credit to Vicky Ponting and his team. Spent a bit of time, hasn't he, Ponting, uh, with Hussey and uh, Siddle there, understandably so as well. Boy, that smile hasn't come off his face.